Well, Tuesday's primary election brought in a record-breaking voter turnout in Woodbury County. Auditor Pat Gill telling us that absentee voting saw unprecedented popularity, partly because of coronavirus concerns. KCAU 9 reporter Jessica Watson tonight taking a look at what Siouxlanders think about the future of mail-in voting. That's our top story at 6. Well, we did um, mail-in voting, and uh, that process was pretty good. We usually don't do that. I like to show up personally. Linda Ham, like many Siouxlanders, voted by mail for the first time because of COVID-19, helping break the record for the number of absentee ballots in a Woodbury County election. We had um, the largest turnout uh, probably that we've ever had in a primary in Woodbury County. Woodbury County Auditor Pat Gill says there are about 13,000 absentee ballots cast, with 3,400 people voting in person. They were concerned about uh, uh, not being able to participate in elections, so they reacted in a positive way as far as uh, uh, vote by mail. With continued health concerns, many Siouxlanders have mixed opinions about continuing to vote by mail. Very guarded about voting, uh, not just for me, but for other people, because let's face it, not everybody is moral or just or follow the rules. Gill says there are many pros and cons when choosing which way to vote. Uh, vote uh, absentee uh, by mail, have the time to do that research, but there's still plenty of people, and I heard about it yesterday, is that uh, want to go to the polling place to cast their ballot. J.D. Scholten is the Democrat running for the 4th Congressional District and says if mail-in equals more people voting, he's all for it. To find a way as America to get more engaged, and so if it means mail, uh, mail-in ballots, I'm for it, but uh, we got to we make sure that we're more inclusive rather than excluding. In Sioux City, Jessica Watson, KCAU 9 News.